What's up guys, my name is Aaron and welcome to this 1 million coin squad builder which is going to be a hybrid between Bundesliga and the Liga BBA. So this is a squad for somebody which wanted to use some a bit of coins but uh, it is in the 3-5-2 formation though which I personally didn't really enjoy. Play like, how many matches have I played? I played 4 matches with this team in total so far and uh, I haven't really... I don't really know how to play with it because it's really really different from last year's FIFA 352. I absolutely loved that that time. But this year I, I'm like feeling the 442, uh, the second one of, the, of that formation, as well as I like the 41212, really good as well. But anyway guys, we are gonna get started with this squad and as you guys can see in goal, we are gonna start off with a goalkeeper which I actually packed today as I'm recording this, so that is gonna be newer, which is probably the best goalkeeper in this game. He's as high rated as Cassius and uh, who's the other one? Buffon I do believe that is. But anyway guys we are going to start off the Bundesliga side of this squad and the first centre back is going to be Hummels. He's been absolutely amazing. He has scored three goals and corners in four matches so the corners are pretty good with his team but anyway he, he doesn't have the best of pace but he is an awesome player defensively to have in your team. So he doesn't really need to have that much pace when you have this guy beside him with 75 pace and 79 defending and 82 heading. Maybe he pushes forward a bit too much in some opinions but he's a really cheap uh, centre back and he's absolutely worth every single penny and he's played really good in this team. So then moving on into the midfield of the Bundesliga side we are going to have a Bastian Schweinsteiger which I bought for 79.5k. He's maybe a bit too slow but he got some insane shots on him as well as he's pretty solid defensively but the only thing I don't think is that good with him is that he has a high high attacking and defensive work rate which I kind of think ruins a bit because he's getting so tired so quickly. But anyway getting into the right mid that is going to be a Robin which I personally think plays better in a, in a formation which allows a right forward or a, or a right winger. So that's where he's the best and he got high low attacking and defensive work rates as well. So he, this is a really good player if you're playing in, in a formation that suits a right forward. That is the uh, Bundesliga side. Now it is time to go into the Liga BBA side. So the centre back on the left side of the pitch is going to be Sergio Ramos. He's an absolutely amazing player and you can get him 36k which is a bargain. Uh, he got 80 pace, 84 defending and 86 heading. High attacking uh, work rates which isn't too good. Pushes a bit too much forward sometimes but uh, when I played with him he's been really really good. And then we are going to go into the centre defensive mid. That is going to be Charlie which I bought for 66k. Haven't managed to score a single goal with him but has come pretty close with him. Uh, with some insane shots and stuff like that. So I added the powerhouse chemistry style card on him to upgrade his defending and his passing because it is in the center defensive mid role. So we got 66 pace which isn't a loss but it is okay when you when you are in the center of the pitch it's pretty okay. Then going into the left mid I can actually have Cedric, I can have Afli and I can have Dos Santos. So the one which actually has played the best for me is Cedric with his 94 pace. He have three skill moves as well and he only goes 1.6k which uh, isn't too much uh, considering he got 94 pace and uh, he's a silver in the Liga BBVA as well. So the reason why I have this guy is that I don't afford I can't afford Cristiano Ronaldo yet, so I have like 1.6 million coins beside this squad and Ronaldo goes for something ridiculous like uh, 2.5 million or something like that. So I'm saving up to Ronaldo, but anyway guys, into the center attacking mid we go and there we have Andres Iniesta which is an amazing player in this game. His ball control is so insanely good and his balance is also really really good. So we got high attacking and the medium defensive work rates. Force the skill moves and force the weak fit, a really really good player to play with. And he got the decent defending on himself as well. So then we go into the striker, uh, striker formation of this team. There we're gonna have Neymar. I would say he's the best player I've ever played with on FIFA 14 so far. He's an absolutely amazing player. It feels like he feels like he is he's actually better than Ribery with the ball in his legs. So I played with Ribery before on Ultimate Team and he's pretty good as well, but Neymar is just too good with the ball in his legs. He's an absolutely amazing player with 5 skills, 90 pace and 92 dribbling. So then to pair up with him, 
I wanted to have Bale, but I didn't afford that either because that is going to be some insane amounts of price on him. So then I went with Jesse Rodriguez, which actually is a really good player. He's a silver, cost 63k, but anyways, he's a really, really good player with 87 pace, 85 dribbling and 72 shooting. So I put the Hunter chemistry style card on him because I really felt that that was the right card to use on him. Foster skills and Foster weak foot, absolutely a really good player. So yeah guys, it's actually a pretty nice team, but I'm probably going to change up the formation and change a bit round on the team. Probably going to go with a 4-4-2, the second one of that, with two, two central defensive mids. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do, but hopefully you guys enjoyed the squad builder. But anyway guys, stay till the end because there is going to be some clips I scored with this team so enjoy that and if you guys haven't already be sure to subscribe and hit that like button as that would really help me out a lot so yeah guys enjoy the clips have a nice day and goodbye